Hello, I'm Kiana Price Wade and you're watching Round Round Oaks seen only on Cox 9. The school year is coming to a close and all over the Roanoke Valley, parents are starting to think, what am I going to do with my kids for the summer? Summer camp is a good way to fill up some of that free time and let your children experience something new or new things while having fun. Here to tell us about some of what the area has to offer are Scott Ramsburg with Roanoke County Parks and Rec and Leah Goodman with Roanoke City Parks and Rec. Thank you both for joining us. Thanks for having us. Well, wonderful. Well, Scott, we're going to start out with you and give us exactly the age range in which how kids have to be in order to benefit or be a part of the Roanoke County day camps. Well, Roanoke County has camps uh, starting as young as age three, going all the way up to age 17. Wow. Uh, if you're three years old, uh, we start out with some preschool age camps, arts and crafts based things where you can just drop them off for a couple hours a day for three consecutive days to give them kind of a sense what summer camp is like. As you get older, we have uh, arts and crafts based camps, things like uh, Knights of the Round Table Camp and um, we have Aquatic Super Soaker Camp at the New Green Ridge Recreation Center. Uh, so these are all half day programs uh, designed to give them a little bit of fun during the summer. Uh, then we also have uh, some overnight and full day programs available. Roanoke County operates Camp Roanoke, which is a traditional co-ed residential outdoor summer camp. They mm. base uh, most of their focus is on environmental education and uh, adventure. The younger kids can stay just for the day with free satellite transportation from Tanglewood Mall. And as they get older, they go on offsite trips every day. Things like caving and uh, whitewater canoeing, kayaking, uh, oh. even rock climbing. Um, and of course, if they're not into the outdoors, we also have some <laughs> enrichment programs that are intended for working parents, things like kids in, kids in camp, day camp, uh, where they go on field trips every day, they get a snack every day, but it's really intended to as, as a drop off for uh, parents who have other things to do during the day. And additionally, one more at Green Ridge Recreation Center this year, sort of the same thing, it's called Green Ridge Summer Day Camp. Now, when you say the day, because everyone's day is a little different, that's hours beginning from what time to ending to what time? Uh, 7.30 a.m. to 6 p.m. for the Kids in Camp program. Wow, that is the day. <laughs> that's a full day full yes. program right there. Wonderful. Now, you gave us a few examples. Can you give, share with us a couple more examples of what Roanoke County is offering this summer? Okay, well, uh, we can go into a, a little more depth. Uh, there's a new program, actually, uh, called Green Ridge uh, half day combo camp mm -hmm. which allows you to combine some of our specialty programs that I talked about some of those half day camps with uh, with a and turn it into a full day camp at Green Ridge Recreation Center uh, for an extra fee so even if you you have let's say you want to go to a certain arts and crafts camp or a certain mm -hmm. sports camp you combine that turn it into a full day program and I forgot to mention of course the athletics camps we are Parks and Rec we have over 13 different sports things like basketball baseball lacrosse soccer football camps and these are all skills camps designed to to get them prepared for team play in the fall building on the fundamentals of, of each sport excellent and real quickly I, i'm sure there's a different range of ranges of fees for that right yeah with 150 different weeks of camp we have a, a lot of different fee structures but basically uh, a half day camp is going to run between 60 and 90 dollars a full day camp is going to run about 125 to 175 and then the overnight camps for the older uh, campers at camp roanoke are going to run 390 and up Okay, and that's per week. And th those are those are weekly fees. Correct? Okay, great. Now, Leah, on to you and Roanoke City Parks and Rec, and what all you guys have to offer. Give us a little, a few examples of what Roanoke City's Parks and Recs are doing this summer. Okay, well, we have the traditional lineup of athletic camps, the Star City Athletic Camps. We have baseball, soccer, uh, football, all kinds of different sports, even cheerleading. Um, you can do that if you're age three, all the way up to age 17. Uh, we also have a lot of nature camps offered at the Mill Mountain Discovery Center. So uh, young kids, uh, older kids can find something to do outdoors with the Discovery Center. Excellent. Um, we also have new this year Sciencational Camps, which is a series of science camps. So we have um, archaeological dig camps, Egyptian dig, um, lots of different cool science camps yeah. that have really never been offered in the area before. So. Sounds like a lot of fun. And do you have to be a city resident in order to take part in these camps? Mm -mm, anybody okay. can. Anyone's welcome. I guess the same is true for the county. That's you don't right. have to necessarily live in the county. Absolutely. And how much does it cost to attend Roanoke City Day Camps? Well, all of our camps vary. They start anywhere from $29 up into um, 100 and, and then more, but most of our camps are under $100. And are there any scholarships that uh, that residents can take advantage of? Yes, we have scholarships available. It's based on need, and uh, uh, participants can get up to $200 per year, and you can call the main Parks and Rec office at 853-2236 to fill out a form. Okay, and we'll have that information on the screen for our, our viewers to, to take down. And where can parents go to in order to 
see what all you guys are offering and to register? Well, we have a website set up. It's uh, www.roanokeva.gov forward slash camps. And we have our summer camp guide with everything we have available. You can register right there online. Great. And where can parents find out their information to take a part of Roanoke County's offerings? Similarly, we'll direct you to the website first. Okay. The website is www.roanokecountyparks.com. Dot com. Um, there's all the camps information there. If you click on the link on the left-hand side, it says summer camps. And you can also download our summer camps program guide on that website or pick it up at one of our recreation centers. Great. Well, no excuses for these young people to stay cooped up in the house. Plenty of good things going on in our valley. Get outside, even if outside is not. Outdoors isn't their thing. Sounds like there's a lot of fun things to get into. And if outside isn't your thing, sounds like there's things that are keeping you nice and cool in the indoors as well, right? Absolutely. Absolutely. Wonderful. Well, we're... We're looking forward to it, Jinx. <laughs> Thanks, guys, both for joining us today. And, of course, you can find out web links to both Roanoke County Parks and Recreation and Roanoke City Parks and Recreation on our community calendar during the break. I'm Kiana Price-Wade, and you're watching Round Roanoke on Cox 9.